Water Signs, welcome back to the channel. It's me, OU, with another tarot card message for you. We got another set of readings for the day. Now, don't they hold uh, church and Sunday service twice a day? <laughs> well, we're out at the park during the magic hour. It's right up on, what, a little after 8 o'clock, maybe 5 or 10 minutes after 8 o'clock. Man, does, is time really relevant here? <laughs> Like, share, subscribe, add value to the channel so that we continue to grow. Let's see what uh, message is uh, we have for you. What's the current energy? What's surrounding you? What's actually coming towards the Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio? All right. Using my favorite deck, of course, we in here with the Light Sears Tarot deck. So let's get these messages over quick before these mosquitoes get too hazardous out here. All right. Hopefully you enjoyed your day. Hopefully you've been enjoying the readings that I've been uploading to the channel so far. Subscribers are slowly going, man. I'm proud of you guys. Thank you. Thank you. You like me. You really like me. <laughs> Grounding your reading today is, yeah, someone going towards their passion. This could be a content creator or content creation. Now I'm getting, uh, what I'm getting is someone watching something. So this could be like someone um, spending the Sunday uh, at a movie theater or at some sort of, I'm getting a park as well. This could also be uh, sexual attraction or sexual uh, chemistry or energy. You could be using that uh, sex energy to put towards whatever that you're advent adventuring towards. All right, this could be someone physically active or physically gifted. All right. That's what's grounding your energy. Let's make this quick for the water signs. Yeah. There's a lot of, um, either a lot of people that's attracted to you, extremely attracted to you, uh, Knight of Wands, marching to the beat of your own drum, firing your heart's content, right? The fire's right on her solar plexus. Uh, the drum is right between her legs, uh, the sacral chakra, where all the heart energy comes from. You could also be looked at as the black sheep of the family. This could be an OnlyFans model. Uh, but yeah, a lot of people uh, fighting to get to your flame, or um, they're fighting to get your attention here. This could have been some sort of a physical, are we getting art, like a literal fighting here? I'm not sure. We do have two of wands, so again, a lot of passions. People are spectating you, or this could be some sort of a voyeurism. Yeah, people are, are spectating and they're wanting to come towards you here. Mm -hmm. Ace of Swords, they're thinking that they could either learn something from you or they can experience some sort of a new journey or adventure with you here. Now this could be subscribers and followers going along with you on your journey. I'm not sure if you're, again, a content creator or you're documenting something here. This could be a traveler. Again, tra traveling, we have the globe here, the van, you know. The traveling van is what they say, the traveling caravan. So you could be a martyr possibly, but this is the truth. So you're a truth teller, you're a storyteller. You tell campfire stories out in the wilderness. So maybe you're a nature enthusiast, enthusiast as well, yeah. Uh, with the world nowadays, everyone is so engrossed with the city life, so you could be viewed as the black sheep or the black horse of the family, going back to traditions. Mm -hmm. Again, if the grid goes out, the electrical grid goes out, huh, everyone's going to want to come to the spiritualist or the naturalist to get candles, right? <laughs> we forget about these things. Uh, let's see, what other messages we have? We just passed 333. We got the Queen of Pentacles here, yeah. This is uh, Virgo Energy. Someone, um, possibly a female, I try not to bring up genders, but I mean, energy is fluid and I have to work with what I see here on the card. So, of course, for me, Virgo is a secretary. So almost like the second in command when it comes to the business, other than the boss, right? The, the, the CEO the, or the boss always has a secretary that generates their itinerary. So you could be dealing with a business owner, a boss, some sort of a secretary, a mother figure could be invested in Airbnbs. We see here with the Three of Pentacles, providing multiple people with a place to stay. A real estate agent, possibly. Again, people are wanting to work with you. They're trying to, okay, this could be trying to climb the corporate ladder, literally. Mm -hmm. Or people could be trying to um, befriend you because they see you have upward mobility here. This is where that idea originated from, upward mobility. Someone's very intelligent, possibly a genius. They're having an aha moment with the Ace of Swords, which is the truth coming to them. And then we see the crow uh, flying upward. So that's why I got the idea of upward mobility, especially with all this knowledge. Knowledge is power. And climbing the stairwell to abundance here. So from the Ace of Swords to the Queen of Pentacles. Again, you're opening up some sort of a business here. 
or you're providing some sort of a business acumen or possibly a business course. But yeah, again, a lot of people coming towards you. That's what I have for you here today, Water Signs. Yeah, very creative people. So you're helping creative people uh, get into business ownership or small business uh, creation, uh, something like that. Documenting the process here, Ace of Swords, Queen of Pentacles. Um, possibly writing a book, maybe some sort of a pamphlet. Uh, I see a lot of products being created as well. But that's what I have for you. Like, share, comment, subscribe, add value to the channel here, Water Signs. Bring more Pisces, Cancer, Scorpios into the reading. Catch you guys on the next one. Peace.